Hello again. Uh, in the last video, I showed you, like in a couple of videos, like how to write a title tag and a meta description tag. And then now I'm going to talk about the URL structure. By the way, uh, sometimes people ask me, like, uh, okay, uh, now as we are writing the title and description, and if you are non technical, means you have no idea, like how to add them into your pages, then uh, you don't need to worry about that. Like, you just need to understand your content hierarchy and you can just make a word document and then you can send it to the designer and instruct them that these should be added as your title tag and meta description tag in the back end of your page right or if you are using wordpress then uh, I, I would recommend using a plugin called yoast seo that will also make it possible for you that you can play with these title and description tags easily I will explain them into some other videos next time so now I'm going to talk about how to structure your URL so what you should consider consider uh, your title tag we started with the service name or the product name then the location and the category and then the name of the company when it comes to the URL you will be putting your domain name or the company name in the beginning definitely and then the second thing should be your category for example i can say digital marketing courses because content marketing course comes under digital marketing course so i am putting digital marketing course as a category as a second thing here in the type in the url and then uh, you will be mentioning the name of the product or service at the end okay so this is the right structure again you will not have to worry about how it will be implemented but you should discuss it with your designer or developer or your agency they will help you to fix it for you but this is a right way of representing your urls even if you can if you are having a domain name that is also google friendly seo friendly that will help means if your domain name contains some of the product name or the service name in the in the domain name itself that will help otherwise you can even you can focus on the category and the product name in your url structure so hope that helps thank you so much